the magical feeling of match day and the desire to lose yourself in the moment, that's what today is all about. A meeting of two talented sides ready to go at it in front of a capacity crowd, not to mention the eyes of the wider football world. Follow every twist and turn right here on EA TV. A warm welcome on what is an ideal night for football, you've got to say. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position, and alongside me is the former Arsenal and West Ham midfield player Stuart Robson. And this is where it all starts in the UEFA Champions League. The group stage and match day one. My goodness, so much to look forward to. It's Sparta Prague facing Salzburg. Well, I'm looking forward to this one, Derek. It's so important that you get off to a good start. So let's hope both sides go for the win here and we get an exciting match. Amar Dedic. Players waiting in the centre. No chance, perhaps. Well, body in the way. He'll be delighted to have won the ball, having made that difficult challenge. This is the lineup for the visitors today. Well, they're going to play with a back five and three up front, which means the midfield two will have a lot of work to do. These two will certainly need to be at their best today in what looks like a 5-2-3 formation. to keep hold of the ball there. Good piece of closing down. And back to Peter Vidal Jensen. Room to manoeuvre on the wing. Plenty of support here. to play it in. Well, pass after pass, maybe they can chisel an opportunity. Just couldn't play that decisive ball. Sorensen. Sadilek. Anak. Velko Bermatjevic is with Preciado. Kuchta. Oh, my three. And that piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. Short one. Lucas Sadile. Determined defending. to clear. 
Well, they're certainly getting closer. You just sense that the goal is coming. They're playing so well at the moment. Well, they can't dwell on not getting the rub of the green. Perhaps they can create another chance now. Crossing possibilities. Fruitful looking attack. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. Lachi. Can he give them the lead? of Brazilians there. The defenders know they need to get tighter. Well, it looks so promising, but a goal kicked the outcome. But he's been the standout for his side so far, don't you think, Stuart? Well, I'm sure the manager will be delighted with him. He'll have drilled it into them to keep their focus, keep playing through to the half-time whistle, and it's certainly put them in a good position to go on and win this now. So the two teams have switched around, and the second half is underway. Past him. Cleared away, cop 
comprehensively. Possession lost by Salzburg. Messiano. Sadilek. Stopping it. But they dealt with the threat first. Can they create something from here? Who can he pick out? Fernando? Just passing. Stop to shoot and go. Sadilek. Well, maybe a good position from which to counter. Played into the box. And so by the keeper. And with play stop, they will make the change now. to bring that attack to an end. Well, they continue to advance, and a lot of options here. It's the strength to hang on to it. He's foiled them on his own. They're not giving their opponents any time to breathe. minutes to go in this one. Well, that's good defending. Well organised at the back. Birmanchevich. And a tidy tackle. Continues his run. Cross. It's hard to do it inside your own penalty area. Fifteen minutes left for play. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Chance to break. Good looking ball. And still they wait for the 
another chance. The cross is on. this stadium the fans are driving the players on here surely they're going to hang on now Sadilek Kuchta showing a real will to win the ball Jensen has it. Giving it their all in search of an equaliser. A good and fair challenge. start you've got to say well it's not the start they wanted it puts them under a bit of pressure going into the next game they need to bounce back now and I think it's fair to say he'll be happy with his own contribution in this game Stuart well, he obviously scored the winning goal but it was his overall performance that impressed me most he was on fire today 